you know, a lot of guys just think it's a, just a game of footy, but it's not. It's it's a lot more than that. It's my livelihood. It's um, yeah, it means so much to me. And um, you know, I just I sort of I don't know. I think it's been a lot harder because it's my second long term one. Yeah, you know the with the ACL, um, you know, I was able to. It was my first major setback and I was able to wipe that. And this one's just been a bit of a tougher pill to swallow. I'm, it, I'm not yeah. too sure why. And it's hard. The, the hardest part is just seeing the boys. I remember the other week I was in there lifting and seeing the boys leave to get on the bus yeah. to go. You know, yeah. And I was in there training by myself. Like That's just little things that um, sort of stick with me. But um, I remember speaking to James Tahuna, our wrestle coach, and mm. something he he's told me how um, – he had something like 13 or 14 surgeries in across five years. And he was saying uh, he always thought that you know, he may not be physically capable at the time, but mentally the steeliness that he gained from that, mm-hmm. he came back mentally stronger in the end. And that's what I'm – that's really sort of sat really well with me and um, been thinking about that a lot. He, he might not have thought much at the time, but it stuck with me a lot as well. And I'm just hoping that, uh, you know, I'll come back – coming out the other side – um, yeah, my strongest I've ever been.